I'm Paul Offit, talking to you today from the Vaccine Education Center at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Hepatitis B is an infection that spreads through blood and affects the liver. It can lead to serious long-term illnesses, such as cirrhosis or liver cancer later in life. Although nearly 300 million people in the world are living with hepatitis B, many people don't know much about it. Hepatitis B is transmitted through direct contact with blood. Because large amounts of the virus stay in blood, a person can be infected after exposure to quantities of blood too small to be seen. One of the most common ways this virus is transmitted is from a mother to her child during childbirth. But it can also spread accidentally in ways that many people don't think about, such as sharing common household items that could have unnoticeable amounts of blood, like washcloths or nail clippers, or from a bite in daycare, or from contact with blood during sports. It can even be spread from getting tattoos if the equipment isn't cleaned properly. Anyone can get hepatitis B, but infants and children are particularly vulnerable. An infant who is exposed to the virus has a 90% chance of developing a lifelong infection. That's why the hepatitis B vaccine should be given soon after birth, within 12 to 24 hours. This is a vulnerable period. Early vaccination against hepatitis B has served us well. In the 30 years since infants have been getting this vaccine at birth, we have virtually eliminated this disease in young people. Why would we stop now, knowing how successful we have been 